Well, I already paint from an age of, I think around 20, 22. At night time I did wake up and couldn't sleep, sometimes for hours, sometimes for days. So I did uh, make a start with painting. This went on for almost 20, 25 years. Uh, till the last years, I did want to know uh, Jackson Pollock and did want to know who was Sam Francis. Because before, I did not know anything about art. I was not even realize what I was doing, and um, had also not the idea that I did need it. I just, just did need it for myself, like uh, breathing. It is a part of your life. I uh, make most of the time um, abstract expressionism. I'm a Dutch artist. I'm born in 1965 and already paint now for the last, last 25, uh, 30 years. I try to make the best out of it and to make something new, to make a creation that I stand for it and say, wow, is this happening? Did I do this? And then on the end, if um, I'm finishing and it's like a, a totally new creation, then I'm like, yes, wow, I can wake up everybody, I can dance before the canvas and be happy about it. That's more or less the way I work. I started painting, to be honest, uh, on a moment that I was sad, I was very sad. I have um, been grown up with a lot of um, alcoholism. Uh, it was not a nice situation as a child to grow up. And I use painting to take care that all the sadness get away and I paint my way to happiness, say it this way. And now I'm happy enough to take care that on the moment I'm feeling sad or I have the feeling like I can't change a thing about the world that I'm getting in my studio and that I paint. I'm using a dripping and pouring style and you see on all my paintings my signature just by dropping and pouring style. It's really my own style but I did start uh, around 25 years ago with little birds on the sea, the uh, super realistic, uh, never an abstract. On the moment I had my abstract, you saw my signature. Every paint you can see, it's Caroline who makes it. Because I always have the choice of the colors, uh, the bright colors. I love, um, if I'm going to the forest, if I'm going to the sea, I like to use those bright colors to see them back. If you find, um, as example, uh, a springtime, you will find all those bright colors back you will find even each line, three or four colors in one line. To make sure that you feel the spring. Not that you just see the spring, you have to feel the spring. That's what I try to do with it. What I feel sorry of is that I never had a chance to go to art school. You know, if you grow up um, in a middle class family, my um, father was turning around when I was 11 years old never look back, leave three children and a mom alone and there was no money to go to any school. There was um, a kind of you go to school and directly go to work. I'm not uh, complaining. I did get my own um, uh, restaurant, did work in it, was happy with it, making my own money uh, and had a life, had a roof above my head, had a good plate of food and was happy. But that uh, my daddy turns around, that, that makes a difference in my life. That makes that I can go deeper and deeper to paint and deeper in my soul. That's what is happening and that's what is art is all about for me. Through the years I uh, have met a lot of people and uh, did go a lot to art fairs and musea and talk a lot of people. and realized that I didn't have done the art school and some people did tell me that actually it's better because it seems that I did uh, do strange, strange things, uh, things that you are not used to. It's um, negative that you know always or you uh, use all the material on the right way. On the other right, you do strange things. You uh, paint with uh, 
other things, with other thoughts, with uh, other techniques. Uh, it's like uh, you discover your road, where to go, what is your next step, Why, when is borning your next technique, what you didn't uh, know or what you didn't see. I went last Christmas for the first time, I did, uh, went to the uh, Guggenheim Museum in Venezia to see a real Jackson Pollock because all those years I never had heard in the beginning the name of Jackson Pollock. I was already painting a dripping style without knowing or there was anybody before me who did this and did uh, have such a big uh, uh, art hanging there. I did jewelry things. I, did, uh, I love now to go to different museums to see different art. But that did start now, the last years. But before, I just had done year after year, paint after paint. Even in those years that I did paint, but did not put my paintings on the market, I had once in a while a paint where I paint six or eight layers. And I felt sorry that I paint over it because it was just an exercise for me. It was uh, getting at night time, getting out of bed, getting the power and the feeling that I have to, like I have to breathe, I have to paint. So I went to my studio and start to paint. And then at morning time, I'm happy, totally happy, smiling, totally feeling alive, making you, I always say, making you conscious. You have to take care that you live your life to the fullest. And that's what I did try to do by painting, and that's still what I tried.